What is up to everyone? Welcome back to another episode of TNT Genetics. Today, I'm going to try to explain how to get your free growing license. Uh, if you don't grow, you can also get your free medical card, which should be legal in Canada. The only benefits are uh, different suppliers you can go to. What else is the difference? You can carry more on you have more with you and with a smoking card you can legally smoke in public and that work um, no I'm not gonna try here I'm gonna go for a tour such a nice day out so there's this company it used to be called light resources now it's a light clinic L Y T E clinic the link will probably be in the description we'll give that a shot see how well that works it should be okay because it's for medical stuff it's not like but anyways I know it works for Ontario I was checking the website out <clears throat> as long as you have a health card I don't know what BC has or Alberta but it had a section for like the BC health card so you guys must have a health card on out there but our health card is OHIP the government will pay for your growing license here with your medical card like your uh health card I guess would be the way to put it I've been doing it for years the wife has so is tipsy uh, I, I've gotten so many people to go there and known they've had good luck it's been <clears throat> they've had good luck so you go to lightclinic.com you go in there you fill up fill out everything they ask you to it's just a short questionnaire. It'll take maybe five minutes of your time. And uh, once you fill it out, you make sure you leave an email so they can reach out. Hey, puppy. They can contact you and a phone number, of course. What they will do is <clears throat> they will email you. And usually they email you with your appointment so when you sign up they give you appointment like options when you want to do your an appointment and the an appointment is you can do it right at home you can do I didn't mind I work last time all they do is they phone you with like uh, what is it called like a face-to-face -face message um, I, I've been dealing with them so long they just call me on the phone I don't even see the doctor face-to-face -face. Pretty sure they did the same with Tipsy, but he's been doing it for a long time, too. And so, for your appointment, when the doctor calls you, she'll ask you why you need it. Oh, I got bad back pain, sleeping issues. Uh, let's say you have uh, mental issues, like let's say bipolar, schizophrenia, you know, depression. Uh, you have issues sleeping, leg, uh, legs hurt, back hurts, hands hurt, you know. You do got to pick two dispenses, like two places where you want to get your medical weed, your medical cannabis, I should say. So I use the same as Tipsy. I use Broken Coast out in BC and I'm in Ontario. And also I use a local one, which is uh, same as the wife and tipsy uses as well what's it called hexo they're also in quebec too we got a warehouse down here um she'll come on she'll ask you all those questions and say okay you know how much do you think you need a day now the tr trick is here you want to tell the doctor you want to grow your medical cannabis also you want to start growing and she'll say how much do you want to grow like how much and you say five grams a day which gives you 25 out your 25 indoor plants you can also pick when they send you the paperwork to fill out for the government you can also pick you want to do outdoor and indoor so that'll give you five indoor no five outdoor 19 indoor um, I always go with the indoor because of genetics, so I myself can grow 25 indoor. My wife can grow 19 indoor and 5 outside. 
which is great. And it's all free, oh it pays for it, but if you go over the 5 grams a day or 25 plants, then you got to pay, which is costly. So right now, to get if you went to like a hydroponic shop to get your grow license, they would charge you about 400 bucks for what I'm telling you you can do for free. All it takes is your health card and set up an appointment, tell them you want to grow and boom. The longest part of it all is it usually takes them about a week to send you the paperwork here in Ontario anyways. And a week to send you the paperwork then you print off the government application that goes to the government of Canada. You send their paperwork, which the doctor has filled out for you. You send their paperwork, sorry, I just, I lose my train of thought. Their paperwork plus the application for the government, you mail it to Health Canada. And now Health Canada does take their sweet time. It took me about two and a half to three and a half months off the top of my head to actually get my uh, license but now you know I'm, I can legally grow and you do that you know they recommend when you have to renew your growing license every year to plan ahead for four months so you know if your license is ex expect to expire in uh, April start renewing the renewal process in January so that way you have it for sure It's a great way because you know really for cannabis plants to grow legally is shit Just because you have a license to grow 25 Doesn't mean you have to grow 25 You know You because for the legal grow amount is four which includes Which includes um, clones seedlings um, So really if you plant four four plants and let's say you plant four and two of them become male well then you got two you got to throw out and start over again at least this way let's say if you plant ten you plant ten of them and you can weed out the males and then you still got a decent amount unless you, you're going with feminized seeds which if you go with feminized seeds good possibility of Hermes and that is always a possibility I'm just touring around because I'm talking. Yeah, so, I don't know, it's something if, if you're in Canada anyways to think about, especially Ontario, because that's how we all do it, and it's great, nice, easy service to use. I have no complaints. I highly recommend them. I've been recommending them for years, and I'm just surprised that Tipsy and I have never done a video on it, and Yesterday on Instagram last night. I actually Was talking to two people about it and they're like we've never heard of this place I was going to pay like 400 bucks to grow 25 plants. I'm like whoa, 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 whoa go to this website So yeah, check the website out anyways guys. I'm going to end it off there I can talk so much more about this if you want to see another video about getting your license I can um, I can do like a Go through an application on the computer. It's it's easy. Hey, if tipsy and I can figure it out, then anybody can figure it out. Hell yeah, guys! That's going to be it for that video. Make sure you have a great day and stay tipsy, stay tripping, and stay doing what you love. Cheers, y'all.